exact same way, but I do have every season that uh, I have actually bought. This is nice, they'll give me a copy, but I always go out and, and buy it so that, you know. As a gift for someone else? It's dying. It's a dying industry, unfortunately. It's just not, the internet is literally killing a lot of the entertainment industry in terms of revenue, and uh, that's why they added an extra half an hour to Lost, so they could have 45 minutes of commercials, you know, I mean, it's like, We've they need to pull in the money somehow. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And I know not everybody can afford it. Whatever you can, you know, donate to this industry would be great. Because otherwise, it's going to go away. It's really, it's very important. That's what happened with Jenny. Yeah. 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 So, like, so much of their bar was pirated. That yeah, gone. They closed. And didn't ADV go away? Yeah, ADV yeah. shut down. They had some of their stuff off to Funimation and everything. Yeah. Saturday night club, they did the original uh, run of uh, Galleon. Yeah, My yeah. Oh, that's nice. That's wonderful. But yeah, I mean, that's what happens if, if you just watch it on the internet. I mean, support it somehow. Pay for it. Even if you go to the biz site and just pay for the one-time view, that would really help keep the industry going. And that way we can all keep, you know, finding new shows and they'll keep producing it, you know, in Japan. Yeah. Have you ever worked with Steve Staley? Yeah, I just worked with him last week. What's he like? He's wonderful. He's really, really funny. He's got the most amazing singing voice. Uh, one of the... Uh, Former uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles has this great Christmas party every year, and uh, we all sing. It's a great, it's just music, 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 and it's a full concert in this guy's house, and it's great. And Steve gets up and sings every year, and he teaches. Uh, if you guys are ever in Los Angeles and want a good acting or commercial or voiceover class, uh, Steve Staley teaches at Calvinson and Calvinson, and he's, he's fantastic. He's really wonderful. A great human being. Anybody else? Yeah. Do you prefer to work on anime or video games? Does is there a well, difference? I original stuff too, so I'll I'll take whatever and movies. So I uh, I love working on all of it because it's all different and it all uses different parts of my brain, but it's all slightly the same but all very different. So the variety is good. It's like working out doing different machines. It's all going to work your muscles, but different ones yeah. at different times. Do you so. play Do you play the video games that you that you work on or or no, not so much. No. <laughs> no. My husband. He does. <laughs> he does. He loves, loves it. I get him Silent Hill and he freaked him out. He's going to walk back and go, so how's the, don't! I'm so freaked out right now. Oh my god. You scared me. You, know, and, uh, you almost gave him a heart attack, basically. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. But, um, no, I do the Wii Fit. I do the Wii Fit and stuff. I just don't have time. I mean, my, literally my husband is sitting home right now playing Prince of Persia. Nice. And he will play until I get back. And uh, will not have showered. <laughs> so he loves it. He'll get really into the and, and he just. But he has, you know, he's he, my husband's Darren Norris. He does uh, fairly voices for the Fairly Odd Parents. He spots with in Team America. So he's he does the voiceover side of things. Really, I mean, he's sort of he's the one who does that. I do the other side of the glass. And it's you know four hours in the morning, golf in the afternoon. You know, so it's. It's a nice, if you want to do a nice lifestyle, uh -huh. voiceover. Five good, minutes? Good, good. Five minutes? Yeah. Um, are there any voice actors that um, like you really enjoy working with and others that you just want to like slap them in the face or something? No. No? That's the diplomatic answer. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> but the realistic answer. I'm sure there, there are voice, it's like dealing with anyone. You have good days and bad days, and you just try and keep them in the good day mode. And, uh, and everybody's got all crap going on in their life, and it's just like, and I always say, look, the booth, the time in the booth is a time for you to let all that go. It's still going to be there when you're done, but you're not going to get it fixed in the next two hours, unless you have to, and then we'll reschedule. But otherwise, come in here, forget all of that stuff, have fun, and lose yourself in a character for a couple hours. It might give you a new perspective on all that crap that's going on in your own life, and, you know, learn to let it go just a little bit. Um, I've... I did have a problem, a very big problem, with one voice actor, and we worked it out over the years, and now we love each other. So it's, uh, it's, it's, it shouldn't be a personal thing, you know. Sometimes it is, but it shouldn't be, you know. For the most part, it's so much fun. It's really, I could not think of a more fun job than maybe professional skydiving. You know, I just, I love. That would be fun. Yeah. I love what I do, and I really like it. Unless you're afraid of heights. Yeah. Yeah. Well, as a professional voice actor, 